Similar to attachments, expectations and wanting serve only as obstacles in the natural flow of the universal ocean. They create a spark of energy which disrupts the ease of flow. Today I'm going to be reading to you from one of my international bestselling books, Light Codes for the Soul. This is a topic which is extremely important on releasing the ego's expectations. I'm Jackie Lara Herod, the Tigress of the Light. I'm a spiritual mentor, international bestselling author of multiple books, channeler, and the developer of quantum healing modality Fractaline Healing. Imagine the flow of energy being the ripple a raindrop creates when it falls into a still pond. The act of wanting creates a disruption in the ripple. So we ask you, be aware, what do you expect? What do you want? Do your desires serve the current situation? Or do your desires disturb the current flow? In any given case, it can behoove us to become more aware of our expectations and the reactions in response to our wants and desires, both from the universe and from the people around us. Sometimes it's good to want, but sometimes the act of wanting only disrupts a good thing. For example, Perhaps we have a strong desire to be in a relationship, and we work hard to make a relationship happen. But before entering into a relationship, we might be better off single as we continue to heal and align with the love within us. This way, when we do find a partner, we aren't bringing in unnecessary expectations, beliefs, and wounds that could have a negative effect on the partnership. If we are patient and remain open to having an amazing relationship while continuing to connect to the love that we are, we will be in flow with the universe and attract the amazing alignment with a partner. Expectations, big or small, are a creation of the ego. For more helpful and healing passages such as this, you can find your copy of The Little Book of Light Codes and Light Codes for the Soul, available on Amazon and other fine retailers worldwide. I hope you found this interesting and informative. Please let me know what you think in the comments below. If you have any topic suggestions that you would like me to address, please let me know. You can shoot me an email at info at lightcodesbylara.com or you can leave it in the comments below. Until we meet again, I'm wishing you a beautiful, amazing, and a wonderful day. All blessings.